Hoodoo enters this world from a place that is more words than substance. We creatures of thought and sinew are the crossroads of this world and the meaning that keeps it going. One of the ways to make something happen is to use the thread of Mama Spider. This one's nice because just about anybody who can put meaning to shape can get something out of it. Mama Spider's thread catches and holds things. Not just real physical things, but meaning too. Now, a single strand of Mama Spider's thread is thin and unmanageable like any other spider thread on its own. So, you either gotta get a whole bunch of them together, which you'll find is wasteful, or you can wind it together in some other substance that can hold weight, such as jackalope hair or milkweed fuzz. What you pick to spin it with will change how it behaves, so don't go picking willy-nilly. Mama Spider's thread seeks to bring meaning into reality. What you say with the thread will try its darnness to come to be, but just like any other gaggle of words strung together might not sound quite how you intended, so also does the meaning of the substance you choose to spin with change the hoodoo. A jackalope, for example, is a strong but skittish companion, a beast synonymous with mobility. If and you were meaning to make a blanket, what protected the wearer from danger of some kind, understand that a jackalope protects itself chiefly by running away. And the blanket, made from it, might attempt to do likewise. The fiber of milkweed is contained in a heavy armored shell and won't give up that fiber till it's good and ready. Much better for a blanket where you want to stand your ground. This may seem counterintuitive, since how jackalope hair itself is a lot stronger than milkweed fuzz, but a lot of things seem like they'd be suited for something, but they just won't be. Just because of the simple fact that they're going to do what they want to do. Now, these threads ain't going to do much on their own. You're going to have to turn them into something. Most folks will start with string figures. These are nice for getting a handle on what it's going to do, without committing to anything. Because a string figure ain't going to last very long. Downside is, the hoodoo starts up right away, and if you ain't ready, something might blow up in your hands. Wear some chupacabra hide gloves if you're feeling skittish. A blanket, a piece of clothing, string of jewelry, that's going to be a bit more permanent. Note that once it exists, it may not want to unexist. Start unambitiously. That shape you make in your fabric will carry the meaning of what you want done. Keep who and what it is for firmly at the core of your goal. Clarity is more important than looking nice, though handsomeness will make the piece a bit more trustworthy to a lot of folks, so you ought to keep it in mind. Remember that there are two ends to this. What you want done and how it is perceived by reality. Paying attention to not only how you understand something, but also to how other folks might put meaning to something. Might save a finger or two.